I'm really doing this, and you know, I have this out of body experience. Is it really happening? Am I dreaming? Am I? Is it somebody else? I'm just watching myself. And then it's just this noise. Sound, you know, it's just the sound. That's what I'll never forget. It's the sound. Well done, Martina. The last time she looked that happy on grass was the 1990 Wimbledon Ladies Singles Final. <laughs> one for the tennis fans, huh? Yeah. 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 Good one. <laughs> so early in the series, too. Uh, so you've met them all, and now it's time for you to choose who's going to be facing the Bush Tucker trial. One celebrity from each camp will go head to head, and here's a little taste of what's on the menu. It's the ice cream van with yummy lollies of every shape and size and cones with loads of extra toppings which two celebrities will be left licking their wounds at the ice cream van I know. So early in the series? I know. Brilliant. <laughs> and the Lions are now open for Ice Cream Van. The celebrity with the most votes from each camp will go head to head. So, starting with the Reds. For Constable Paddock, do you get it? It's all I know. Come on, 32, 32, or 1. I do, I get it. <laughs> if you think Danny won 3, add 0, 3. To see George coldly go where no man's gone before, add 0, 5. If you think Joel have this one licked, add 0, 6. To see Martina serve and lolly, add 0, 7. Another one for the tennis fans. Yes! <laughs> now for the other team. To see Zucker win some Tucker, add 0, 2 for Carly. The see Esther cool, add 0, 4. If you think Nicholas an ice girl, add 0, 8. If you want to see Robert play the white van man on nine and to give Simon a frosty reception and set. Calls will cost you 50p from a BT landline. Calls from other networks may be higher and mobiles will be considerably more. 15 cents from each call goes to charity. Details of which can be found at itv.com forward slash celebrity. Lines close later in the show. Votes cast after that time will not be counted but may still be charged. Back to the action though and while Martina had come down to earth with a bump, the rest of her group were still up in the air. As for the yellow team, they'd be facing a slightly soggier journey into camp. horrendous ride of my life, the helicopter and trek through the jungle. I hate frogs. Oh. <laughs> I hate them. What's the point of them? They're just slimy, green and look ugly. Look at that. I mean, look, that is absolutely beautiful. And then we get to a water's edge with feet and a boat. Aha. Oh my God. What do you reckon? Oh, this is rubbish! You've got to cross the lake. Oh, this is bad. Jump, you've got to use jump the floating feet in the boat, follow the map to reach the other side. It's a long way. There's a million things down under there. Crocodiles, water snakes. Fingers crossed we won't fall in, we'll stay on the dry boat. And, um, yeah, and we'll get across safely. One of the things was sort of motorised shoes, and the other two were unmotorised huge shoes. Okay, so me and Carly are happy, I think, to do the more strenuous ones. Okay. As you know, Carly's fit and I'm just stupid. And then you do the boat, I think, and you can do the jet. I was actually thinking, what, what, what are these two up to? This is all very uh, slightly uh, patronising, but I don't mind. They do all this girly-girly business, and they talk about their nails and the mascara, but when it comes down to it, they're, they're warriors. The only other thing I will say is that I've never kayaked in my life, so well, it's an experience. I might not keep up with you. Well, you're, getting, you're being towed. Yeah. Am I? By me. 
That's terrific. <laughs> I don't think that engine is going to pull. Oh, wow. Ah. Oh, Start to get. You get Robert Kilroy Silk falling over every two seconds as you are really trying to steady him. And then you get Esther Ransom sitting there, you know, graceful and sort of, you know, looking absolutely great while, you know, I'm up to my boobs in swamp water. When you need the rest, just let them float apart. Oh, yeah, what is it? Shit, what's that? Don't even think about it, Carly. It's lovely living. <laughs> Every now and then I felt like a duchess, and every now and then I felt very guilty, and every now and then I felt very worried. Just as Robert was getting the hang of it, and you thought, he's a hero. He fell in. Oh, bless him. How good a swimmer are you, Robert? How good a swimmer are you? It was too far to go back nearer to swim so I swam pushing the kayaks and dragging Esther behind and Esther helped with my hat and my failing as fast as goes along. Oh look at them! I think this is easier than your one or am I speaking no, too soon? I think it is! Watch it! Carly's screaming about what could be underneath and I'm thinking really I didn't want to think about that but now you've told me I'm screaming myself. I'd even take my shoes off to get on this floor, let alone put my feet in the water, swim in the water, fully dressed, you know, not, not knowing that what's lurking below. <laughs> they lean it right at the end and really just think about helping everyone else that really thought I'm too exhausted, so I just sort of wave them in. seem to be a little bit of an achievement, given all our failures, that we should actually present Esther on to the bank twice. Well, I could be drawn. I love that. I could be drier, says Esther, as she's used Kilroy's hat to paddle <laughs> yeah. while her own is, is dry atop her head. Based on her head. I can't even believe how many times Kilroy fell in the water. I know. It's almost as if that contraption was deliberately designed to make him look stupid. Yes. Almost. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, back with the red team. It was time for the rest of them to jump out of the plane. And first up was Star Trek legend George Decay. But this was going to be no problem for a bloke who was miniaturised by the spy rod Epsilon waves from a Planted in the Territon colony. <laughs> oh, you're a secret trucky, are you? Who, me? Me? No, no, no. <laughs> Fantastic. Well done! We survived. <laughs>